Alright, Little Dragons, we are going to get warmed up um, right after our Batwin. A couple things that I want you guys to think about is I want you guys to think about your attitude, alright? Attitude is the way you act. What you guys are doing is I want you guys to make sure you have a positive attitude and you guys make sure you make right choices in the way that you're acting, whether it's good or bad. You always want to make sure you have a positive attitude in every situation, okay? So face front, go tree it! Cook it! All right, first thing we're gonna do is you guys are gonna be doing jumping jacks with Mr. Martin. We're gonna do 30 seconds worth of jumping jacks, okay? Is everybody get ready? Mr. Martin, why don't you demonstrate one first? Yes, sir. All right, now we're gonna do 30 seconds worth of those, okay? So re get ready, get set, and go. 30 seconds. Go ahead, make sure your feet are apart, your hands are above your head, little dragons, you got it. All right, keep going, little dragons, go, go, go. You guys got 15 seconds left. 15 seconds, do the best jumping jacks you can. All right, 10 seconds, 10 seconds, see if you can do as many as Mr. Martin. And freeze, right there. All right, little dragons. Now, the next thing that we're gonna do is we're going to be getting our legs warmed up a little bit more. So we're gonna be doing squats. When we do squats, all right, so all you guys stand at attention like this. Now put your feet apart. Now put your hands up like this. Now you guys are gonna bend all the way down and then you're gonna come all the way back up. You gotta keep your back straight. Don't bend over. Make sure your back is straight up and down, okay? You're gonna do 30 seconds worth of squats. All right, Mr. Martin, everybody get ready. Okay, first go, tree it. Now go fever. Now hands up. Now squat 30 seconds, go. All the way down, all the way up, dragons. Make sure, see how Mr. Martin's keeping his back straight. He's making sure his heels stay on the ground as he does this. This is very important when you guys are building up those strong leg muscles. Okay? We are halfway done. We got 15 seconds. 15 seconds left. Come on, dragons. 10 seconds left. Alright, five seconds. Three, two, one, and step to a yes sir. Yes sir. All right, there we go, little dragons. Now, next thing we're gonna do is this called a lunge. This is gonna build really powerful leg muscles so you guys have amazing kicks, okay? So you're gonna put one foot in front, one foot behind. Now, hands are gonna be up, you guys are gonna drop down, and then you guys are gonna come up, just like this on one side. You're gonna do 15 seconds on this side, then we're gonna do 15 seconds on the other side. So get ready. Set, everybody put one foot in front, one foot behind you, hands up, back straight, and go one. Now go two. There, now keep going all the way, just like Mr. Martin. You guys are gonna keep pace with Mr. Martin right here. All right, there we go. Now five seconds, and we're gonna switch. And switch feet. Now other foot's in front. Now you're gonna do lunges down there, building strong leg muscles. Your legs should start to be getting tired. Okay? Keep going, five seconds, dragons, five seconds, let's see it. Make sure one knee down, one knee over that front foot. Now freeze right there. Okay, standing at attention like this. All right, now, next thing that we are going to be doing is we are going to be doing push-ups, right? Now that we worked on having strong leg muscles, it's important that we make sure we have strong arm muscles too. So, you guys are gonna go down just like this. All right, on your knees this way. Now we're gonna do sets of five together. All right, so me and you guys, we're gonna do sets of five. Put those hands right here. Now take your hands, put them out like this. Now you're gonna drop those hands to the ground. Now we've been working on really good push-ups to keep ourselves in shape during this period of time. So everybody, pop your toes back. Go like this, go one. Now go two. Only thing that bends is your arm, three, four, and five. Now everybody, sit really tall like this, okay? You guys should only be bending here on your push-ups. We're gonna do two more sets of these till we do a total of 15 push-ups. Ready? Take those arms, put them together, pop them down here, just like this. Pop your toes back, go one, two, three, four, and five. All right, dragons, one last set of push-ups. You guys ready? Okay, take those hands, put them together one last time. Put them out here in front. Now go here, toes back, go one, two, three, go four, and five. All right, little dragons, that is going to be our warm-up today. 
All right, guys, next we're going to get stretched out. So first thing you're going to do is you're going to pop your feet apart shoulder width. Okay, and you're going to plant your hands in the center, and you're going to slowly start to slide your feet out a little bit of this. Okay, once you get to where you can start to feel the stretch, go ahead and freeze. Okay, then you're going to take your hands and reach over to your left side. Good, now walk your hands over to your right. Hands back in the middle. Now you guys are going to start to rotate your hips from one side to the other side. So you're going to go left side, you're going to hold for a second, then rotate to the right side. Hold for a second. And you guys are going to do this back and forth, just getting our muscles really loose. Good, now hold on your right side. Try to go even further. Good, now rotate back to your left side and hold. Good, now while you're on your left side, you are going to come out of your stretch and then you are going to bend your left leg forward and try to drop your back hip to the floor as low as you can. Straighten your leg back out in splits and then rotate back to your right side. Okay, do the same thing on this side, pull your leg in, drop your right knee forward, drop your left hip to the ground as low as you can. Straighten your right leg. Go all the way as far as you can in middle space. Once you're low to the ground, you're going to drop your forearms. And slowly sit back. Take your hands, reach around the center. Now reach over, grab your left foot, try to get your nose on your knee. Okay, reach over to your right side, nose on your knee. Push your left leg in front, pull your right leg in. Reach forward, grab your toes. Now switch feet, other side. Legs in, butterfly stretch. Try to get your nose on your toes. All right, go ahead and stand up and shake your legs out. All right, guys. So next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna be working on our kicks now. All you need is you need either one, you can use a towel, um, you can use um, an old belt, you guys can use um, a string, and you guys need something to hold it. So whether it's somebody helping you, or you guys can kind of tie it to something and have it um, be hanging down. May, the main thing that I want you guys to do is I want you guys to make sure that you guys have permission, especially if you guys are um, a younger student, that means under 18 years old, you guys have permission before you tie something on and you guys start kicking it, making sure that it's safe. Okay, so first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna work on working on your front kicks with a string. So, Mr. Martin's gonna demonstrate, I'm gonna hold this here. Okay, now, I'm gonna stand to the side, he is going to do his front kick, making sure it's right on that line, and he's gonna kick this with his front kick, just hitting the belt and not anything else, okay? So ready, he's gonna go one. Now, two. Now at home, you guys should be following along, okay? So if you need to pause this and get this set up, then pause this and get it set up. All right, we're gonna start from the beginning, ready? Go one. 
two, three, four, and five. Now other side, switch feet, front kick here, ready? One, two, three, four, and five. Excellent. Now we're going to switch the exact same thing with the side kick that everybody knows. All right, because we've all been working on the exact same thing. So ready, step up, go one. Now step up, go two. Ready, and three. Ready, go four. Ready, go five. Now, other side, exact same thing. Ready, go one. Now, ready, go two. Ready, go three. Ready, go four. Ready, go five. Now, as you guys get better with this, you guys can start to shorten what you guys have to hit, or I can start to go like this. And then he's got to do psychic and hit this. So ready? Step up and go one. Now, the goal would be to hit this without hitting whatever it's tied to, all right? Or hitting whoever's holding it. Again, you need permission before you do this at home, okay? You want to get it to the point to where it's as little as this, and you guys can do um, a complicated movement, whether if it's a front kick, ground kick, or maybe a different technique in order to only hit the little piece, okay? That's going to be our kicking drills for today. Chun B for form number one. Left leg steps forward into a front stance. Left low block. Right number two front kick. Land forward in a right front stance. Left reverse punch to midsection. Right punch to midsection. Left leg steps forward to a left front stance. Left punch high section. Right foot moves to a middle stance. Right knife hand strike to midsection. Yeah. Right, number three side kick, land in a right front stance. Right, inner form block. Left foot steps into a left front stance, left punch to high section. Right leg steps forward into a right front stance, right low block. Left, number two front kick, land forward in a left front stance. Right, reverse punch to midsection. Left punch to midsection. Right foot steps forward into a right front stance. Right punch to high section. Left foot moves to a middle stance. Left knife hand strike to midsection. Yeah. Left number three side kick. Land in a left front stance. Left inner form block. Right foot steps forward into a right front stance. Right punch to high section. And bro. Chariot. Yeah. 